Having liberated the hourglass and become keeper of time, my next task was to restart history. Not beholden to past events, I was free to craft a new era. It was with humility and restraint that I approached this blank canvas. After careful preparation, I began work, painting over the darkness. After eons passed, I sketched out the realms. After eons more, I brushed them in with life. In my new era, all beings will have the opportunity to find peace. Whether or not they do will be their responsibility. For my power only permits me to begin this endeavor. It is the duty of mortals to finish it. Alright, what's up y'all? Snoozy Games in the bit. I'm playing some Mortal Kombat 1. I did play it a little bit earlier just to get, you know, just to warm up because I ain't played Mortal Kombat in a minute. I know the story, but I ain't played it in a minute. But basically, I did play MK11. I just didn't, you know, you know, I ain't put it on the channel at the time. So it's not there. So don't go looking for it. Just look for this one. But basically, I know the rundown. I know the characters. I'll let y'all know. I ain't gonna I ain't gonna put it on hard, not this time, y'all. Near the real studio My friends, your patience is about to be rewarded. For I have saved the best for last. You talking about me, y'all? I have I'm recently the discovered a cure all of unrivaled potency. It will soon be on the shelves in every home of Outworld. Oh, word? This elixir is crafted from an ancient recipe. He got something crazy. It has Patreon flowers, Margovian nectar. What is he? Is that? Is he talking about lotion? He's selling lotion, y'all? All this and more infused with powerful... This dude's selling magic. Shaolin lotion, y'all. There is a village in the next canton over. Where everyone has purchased this miracle cure. Overnight, all diseases, even Tarkat, have disappeared. That's that's cap. Ain't nothing can fix now, that type of ugly. Potent is expensive. And I am sure you're asking yourselves, can I afford it? Hell no. But the true question you must ask is, can I afford to but, be without But can you beat me in intellectual combat, you lie, though? Shang Tsung. You Your fart. are useless. I'm sorry. You are. Someone fool enough to have believed you. My daughter was dying when you came to my farm. You promised a miracle, and I gave you all I had. Yo, why he looked like a hot dog later, with clothes on, though? She was dead. Like, he looked like a buff <laughs> hot dog, y'all. My magic could not have failed her. There it's not magic. No magic. I took your elixir to an imperial mage, and you know what she said? She threw it it's on the ground? Just borzang tea! Ah, oh, hell no. Nah. mistaken, kind sir. My elixirs are of superior quality. Their efficacy is guaranteed. Yo, hey, yo, they, they really about to beat this old man, though. Damn. Put him in a casket. He in a casket. Hey, you need to move that bottle though. It looks a little dangerous. I ain't I ain't gonna hold it. Oh, he's still here. Cool, cool. Alright. He could take a beat. 
You know, they just knock the kinks out. He real ready now. Okay, that's that right there. That's Chronica. If you know, if you see MK11, we beat her ass. Long story short. If it's revenge you want, have at it. If it's restitution, there's nothing left. What I want, Shang Tsung, is to elevate you, to make you the great sorcerer that now you can only pretend to be. Shang Tsung, huh? A generous offer. Why me? You are uniquely resilient. Also, she's salty that she's not a keeper of time no more. Traveling outworlds, she didn't know what she was doing. Selling quack cures and fake magic. <laughs> a living. It is barely survival. And you were meant for more. To live among kings, not peasants. <coughs> she but playing since you. Since before you were born. You have been conspired against by those who fear how formidable you could become. How do you know this? Who are you? I am your deliverer, Shang Tsung. Her name's Chronic. Join me, and I will put the realms at your feet. Yo, you see how he's smiling? He's smiling like, yeah, yeah, I just got a promotion. I ain't got to sell no Beijing tea no more. That's what he was staring like. He was staring like, yeah, man, I just got a promotion at work. New era, Kung Lao. Huh. This is a good harvest, Kung Lao. Yes. <clears throat> it is a blessing, Raiden. You would rather we starve? No, no, of course not. That's right, Raiden. But we've worked these fields since we were kids. In 40 years, we'll still be here. Stooped and feeble like old man Wei. <clears throat> Damn. As long as I've known you, you've dreamed of leaving Fengjian. Why can't you be happy here? Our ancestors fought in great I wars. I mean, what are y'all doing? They died with honor and glory. Y'all just plowing grass Stories of our great adventures <laughs> will be passed down for generations. It may not be glorious, but what we do helps the village thrive. I know. But is it so wrong to want some excitement? If that's Sometimes. what you want, may I suggest a bet? Dinner at Madame Bo's tonight. Last hey, that jacket Raiden case. got on kind of fire. You I want that. Faster than me? <laughs> Since when? I probably look. I, I, I feel wrong, like I look Raiden. nice in it, Loki. Cabbage, lettuce. I don't know. I get mixed up about the cabbage and lettuce, y'all. They look the same to me. Both of them fucking green. You already know what that is. That's that tea. I bet, I bet it's good too. That is amazing. I am starving. I wonder what Madame Bo is making tonight. For you two, whatever you want. That's right. Thanks, Wrinkles. Thank you, Appreciate Bo. it. You spoil us. Like the sons I never had. I like her voice. She remind me of like this might sound a little racist, but she kind of sound like one of those ladies from Mulan. Have you two been practicing my lessons? Like I'm just saying As though, we can. like the don't get mad at me. Us little time for martial arts. Since your first words, Kung Lao, you've mouthed nothing but excuses. If you fail to prepare, your preparations will fail you. Good, you haven't forgotten. But we'll see if I make you anything special tonight. I'm glad you're paying. Madame Bo might just pad the bill with her anger. I am paying? You finished work last. But I delivered my cart first. Delivered? Huh. The bet was filled. That's not what I remember. Was it? So that's how it is, eh? What do you say we settle this man to man? Hmm? <laughs> uh, 
Wait, you mean fight? Yes. Right here, right now. That's right. Madam Bo can watch. That's right, Raiden. Right. I'm about to be form. pulling on that mini ponytail you got back there. That little rabbit tail back there. Best two out of three? Fair enough. We must be careful. Madam Bo will kick Bro us out Bro in the back want to join in. Watch. <laughs> He's not ready for this, y'all. He's not for that ready for this. Happen. Watch, watch. You will watch be down this. in no time. Okay, Raiden, I don't, I don't think you know. Look, look, already 10 piece, 11 piece. Hold on, let me tee back on him. Oh! Wait a second, hold on, hold on. Wait, wait, can he actually throw his hat down? Okay, no, that's not it. Come on. Ooh, hold on, hold on. Ah. Hold on, what, what about this move, dude? There you go. See, I, I'm a little nice with it. I like that move right there. You know them Wing Chun punches. What you looking at? You see that old lady over there scared? Okay, okay. I see how you. Uh, uh. Hey, can you handle this though? Can you handle that? Okay, okay. I see you. I see you on up. I know a little air combos too, homeboy. Yeah. Mm, get tossed. What's up? Bring it on. Bring it on. Get some. Light work. I didn't even mean to do him like that, but that was that was a little, you know, first first fight, first fight, right? First fight. That's all I'm gonna say. You haven't beaten me yet. The day's coming, come now. <laughs> he looks salty. Keep telling yourself that. You can kiss my grits. You were hungry. <clears throat> oh, Gave him a everything super Everything was build. delicious, Madam Bo. Thank you, Raiden. You boys are he always look, Raiden looked nice, though. So he looked like a nice guy, low-key. Hey, yo, that... That was going towards the bill. Madam Bo. No, you ain't talking. Do Quay await your answer? Okay, they got ninjas. I have been busy, Smoke. Look how she walk Quay. away. Who she are playing? They? Don't know, but I don't like where this is going. What do we do? Stay ready. Madam Bo, it is a simple choice. Pay for our protection or risk harm to this fine establishment. You'll get nothing from me. That, Madam Bo, is unfortunate. That's that's smoke right there. I know from some of the trailers. Okay, old lady. Oh shit. Yo, I mean that's kinda low of him to beat the hell out of old woman like that. Like as young as he is. You two are brave. But against us, you are in over your head. Hey, we're about to see about that. You don't that. care who you are or who you are with. You better, you hey, I'm gonna be honest, man. Matter. I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna be honest. You better, you better, have, you better have the work. You better have the work. You better have the work, some of you, boy. Look, you don't want none of this. Okay, okay, okay. You kind of mad at it. Damn, man. Okay, okay, hold up. Okay, okay, so he knows some combos, too. Mm -hmm. Get tossed. I popped him on the head real quick. He not ready, man. I used to be at the MK9. MK9 was like the best Mortal Kombat, yo. Like that's, I mean like not the best, but like that's the one I was the best at. And some of this stuff right here, uh, like look at me. Damn, Raiden, I was trying to call you in while I'm over here and get to this dude's ass. Boy, now who's in over his head? 
Also, I don't know if y'all know, but there was a Mortal Kombat out there called Shaolin Monks where you could play as Liu Kang and Kung Lao. It, it was like my favorite Mortal you. Kombat. You could play as other characters Honestly, too, but it was fire. Too. Come on, let's help Madame Bo. Good job, Raiden. Where your hat at though? Kind of disrespecting the hat game right now. Okay, Sub Zero, Sub Negro. I call him Sub Negro, not like because I'm racist or nothing, just because I just like saying that, you know? Sub Negro, because I imagine like if he was black. No idea. Never mind, bro. You interfere with Lin Kuei business. Leave or face our wrath. You ain't nothing. Not happening. Nah, but nah, I, don't, I don't really know if Kung Lao can actually, you know, mess with Luke Kang. I mean, um. Sub Zero, my bad. Popping on top of the head one time. I have plenty. You should have fled when you could. This Kung Lao was like real cocky a little bit, I think. Yeah, get hit with that 11 piece real quick. Okay, sports. I ain't really got no moves like that. Why are you icy though? Hey man, chill out. How many times you gonna throw that shit, sir? Okay, bet. Uh, 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 uh. Damn. Uh, oh. Yo, my bad. Sometimes I be pausing the game. Like when I fight real hard, I pause the game a little bit. I'm not regretting this yet. Ain't it down back there? Oh, oh, so I be like, oh. oh man, come on, Sports. I, I, I got help too. Nigga. <laughs> I was like, yo, he tried to do his little extra. I was like, cut that shit out. Now he got my Shaolin sneakers on his forehead. Oh, man. That was low key kind of cold. All right, bro, who's that old man, though? That old man knows some shit. Incompetent. <laughs> oh, that works. You like that, y'all? Then go before I put you down like the rest of your Lin Kuei. You have right. a prayer against the Lin Kuei's grandmaster. Right. You, don't know no, you don't know nothing about me. See, look. Yeah, I like that right there. Damn. I think I got, I got an idea. What about my? Oh, what about my hit you with this? And then hit you with this? And then ah, oh, yo, if I would have comboed that, that would have been low key kind of crazy. I should probably should have used him. Ah, oh, wow, you had to knock me out of that. Come on, bro. Let's see what your corner game is like. Knucklehead. Get on the ground. Okay, it looks sure like I got a hat, a mask, master? and um, a color palette, I think. Interesting. Kung Lao, over here! 
he threw that hat kind of hard because he still got a dent on the side of his hat, y'all. Madame Bo, she's out cold. She done kicked the oh, bucket. No. Is she dead? Not yet. Yeah, cause like I was like, cause smoke was like the bitch already two feet in the grave. So let me go ahead and put the rest How of the body you? in there. Come out. Any dude that's wearing a wearing like one of those is already like a high tier character. That's Luke so, Kane. Madame Bo, are they ready? A Look bit at Luke big Kane. He looks head, so nice. Perhaps, but they are ready. His eyes are glowing. I, I know, right? am Lord Luke Kang, God of Fire and Protector of Earthrealm. God? Earthrealm? Madame Bo has been preparing you for this moment since you were boys. Today. You have proven worthy of joining my champions. This fight was... a test? Of your ability and character, yes. Jihan, Kui Liang. Imagine Liu Kang screaming, Chi Li! Nah, let me stop, let me stop. I'm just making jokes, I'm trying to have fun, y'all, y'all can chill. So these two aren't thugs? The Lin Kuei is a centuries-old clan dedicated to Earthrealm's defense. You keep saying Earthrealm. Don't you mean Earth? <laughs> you boys have so much to learn. Earth is only a part of Earthrealm. Earthrealm itself is one of many realms. Together, they comprise the whole of the universe. All right, the all realms right. can be fierce, bitter rivals. That's why we need champions to defend ours. The time draws near for the Grand Martial Arts Tournament between Earthrealm and the Realm of Outworld. Held once each century, it allows each realm to demonstrate its strength. While our realms are at peace, there are Outworlders who would prefer us to be at war. Our victory in the tournament will temper their zeal. I've taught you everything I can. You must finish your training with Lord Liu Kang. More training? These two couldn't defeat us. <laughs> huh. What? Do you know who that is? Their punches. Had we Do you know who that back, is? He would not have survived. Oh, God. The monks at the Wuxi Academy await to continue your tutelage. Wuxi Academy. I am ready, Lord Liu Kang. And you, Raiden? Leave Feng Jian? I'm needed here. Earth Realm needs you, Raiden. You'll best serve the village by being one of its champions. True, true, true. Save the earth, save uh, Fijian. I will join Whatever you he was calling that place. First, there are other champions I must gather. <laughs> oh, actually, you know what, y'all? I'm going to have to cut it right there. I'm going to keep recording, but thanks for watching. And uh, go ahead and hit that like button. Subscribe. Do all that nice stuff. Make me feel good. And um, I'll see you in the next one. Snoozy Games out.